program in order to fight this clash. I am a student of history and now teaching at International Islamic University in the department. The earth, when it gives you a mango, let's say a mango, your job is to eat the mango and plant it, replant it, throw it into the soil so that it grows into a new mango tree. That is before. Now, I
appreciate as that. Like, like this is not profane. This is sacred to me because it's my the words of my friends. And if it's even an empty book, it's still sacred because it is an opportunity for me to you could use it to do good things or write good things. So everything in nature or everything around us is sacred. Uh, but we have grown this mentality of some things are sacred, the Quran, the Sajda, the, um, the prayer room, the church, they're sacred, but other places are profane. So we need to overcome this whole dichotomy even within ourselves that they are sacred and profane. But